I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I am a Brookwood Junior High School student. I am loved. My life matters. My teachers have high expectations for me. I have high expectations for myself. When one door shuts, another will open. I will persevere. I will succeed. I am the future. I will not use my hands for hitting or my words for hurting others. I will use them only for helping. Good morning, staff and students. Just a few announcements for today, January 13th. Eighth grade students, you will be taking the winter NWA MAP test on Thursday and Friday of this week. Seventh graders, you will be taking the test Tuesday and Wednesday of next week. All students will test in math first and then reading. Testing will take place from 9.30 to 11.30 a.m. If you do not finish your test in the morning, you will be expected to log back on after lunch at 12.30 to finish your test. Students will not be on live teaching on the days they are testing. Students will be completing choice boards in the afternoon for art, music, and for PE. Only on their two testing days will they be logging on to art, music, and PE choice boards in the afternoon. Students, you will join the meet in the same testing classroom you were in during the fall map testing. Please ensure that you're able to access the this Google testing classroom from the fall as this is where you will be able to log on to the meet to test. All students are expected to log on to their morning meeting at 8 o'clock every day, even on the days they are testing. Seventh graders, this week on Friday, you will be participating in a presentation during science class called Aaron's Law. Aaron's Law was named after Aaron Marin, a young lady who was sexually abused for many years. Aaron's mission is to shatter the silence and stigma around sexual abuse and educate children and empower them with their voice. On January 21st, eighth graders will participate in this presentation. Just a reminder, students, if you have a DRI in any of your classes, you are required to stay on camera for the entire time your teacher is on live teaching. We need to ensure that students are engaged in their teacher's live instruction. Students, this is a requirement if you have a DRI. If you refuse to remain on camera, your parent will be contacted. For all other students, you will need to be on camera when your teacher asks, if you are taking a quiz or test, and also if your teacher calls on you or asks you to respond in the chat, please do so or you will be considered not engaged in the lesson and we will also notify a parent. Students, remember our incentive program is tied to student progress achievement and attendance. You will still be allowed to redeem points for prizes. However, in order to receive your prizes, you, each student must be academic and attendance eligible. If students are receiving a DRI or if they have not been in attendance for more than 5% of the quarter, they would not qualify for the highest tier level of prizes, which does include gift cards. This system is aligned with our Positive Behavior Intervention System, or PBIS, program. Our PBIS program tells us to be safe, be respectful, be responsible. Teachers give one point in each tier when students exhibit all expectations under each category. Students will receive their points paycheck every two weeks, which will keep them informed of their bonus point total. Students, please try your best and earn those points. Remember, you can earn up to 18 points a day. Your teachers should have shared our new prize incentive catalog with you. Students, please remember your points will not be rolling over for quarter three. You must use your points from first and or second quarter to purchase prizes from our new catalog by January 15th or you will lose your points. Students, if you have a D or an I on January 15th, you will not be able to receive your gift cards if you are eligible. If you have a D or an I on January 15th, you will not be able to receive those gift cards. As you may notice, our prize points have increased as students were able to roll over their points from the first quarter. So just a reminder, all students will start with zero points for quarter three, and we will also have a new prize catalog for quarter three. Students, please ensure you're completing all your work on time so you don't fall behind and have to play catch up. There is not many days left of quarter two, so please make sure if you need extra help from your teachers, you just have to ask. Teachers offer extra help at the end of each day from 2.50 to 3.15 p.m., so please speak up if you need help.
Remember, students, try your best to become an iLEAD student. iLEAD stands for Individual Learners Excelling Academically Daily. Each core teacher chooses five students when it's their turn to choose. Every other week, we will show a video recognizing those top five students. Students, please participate in our district-wide online spelling bee. All students are invited. Study the list of words from your teachers for the classroom spelling bee, which will be held in each school in January. Words were also posted on my class dojo, and your teachers posted them in their class dojo as well. Here are some studying suggestions. Start by studying the list that is closest to your grade level. Say the word, spell the word, then say the word again. Practice with an adult. Practice by yourself. Just keep practicing. We want to wish everyone good luck. If you are absent or if you need to see the lesson again, you can request to see your teacher's recorded lesson. This week's cool tool is a review of remote testing expectations. Your teachers will review with you the expectations during their morning meeting this week, and on Friday you will participate in a Kahoot about these expectations. Remember, students, when you are testing for MAP, you have to be on camera while you're testing. Students, please remember to follow your class schedule and log on to each of your teacher's Google Meets at the designated time. Your teachers share a link for their meet in their classroom each day. If you are having any tech issues, please contact our help desk at 708-300-3553 or email helpdesk at brookwood167.org. Remember, when you're online learning, you must follow all our school rules and expectations. Our grab-and-go meals, they're still available for all students Monday through Friday from 9 a.m. till 11.30 a.m. Just pull around to the east side of the junior high to door 12 to receive your grab-and-go meal. We would like to wish a very happy birthday today to Anahi Morales and to Mr. Schmalls. We hope you both have an awesome day. Ms. Ross would like to recognize exceptional work done by 7th grader Amir Sinclair. In the assignment, students were supposed to create Pinterest border Pinterest boards for William Grant Still, an African-American composer and arranger. Amir did an exceptional job. Great work, Amir. Keep it up. Students, please keep trying your best so you can get recognized by your teachers for completing exceptional work. Our math word of the day, universal set. A universal set contains all of the elements under consideration. Our quote of the day, teachers can open the door, but you must enter it yourself. Hashtag Brookwood Strong. Staff and students have a great day.